<laughs> Corrine, you're on the Tom Likas show. Hello. Hey, Tom. How are you? All right, Corrine. Um, I got a question. I work for an automotive business. I always have to go out for lunch with men by myself all the time, and I hate it. I feel like I'm betraying my fiancé by spending this time with men. I don't like it, but I have to do it for work. Mm -hmm. What, 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 what do you do? What do you do? Do you sell? Are you in sales? Yeah, I'm in sales. I'm a sales development executive. I'm, and who are you having lunch with, clients? Well, I have to have lunch with clients. Um, I have to have lunch with, say, our distributors, like people that supply us with stuff. When they're in town, I go out with them. Um, and it's just a common thing. Everybody everybody does it, and it's expected of me to spend well, this time with all these men, right? It's my it's opinion, thing. number one, that you should be with more than one at a time. Yes, and that's what I think also, but it just doesn't always happen that way. Well, I certainly think that you should work that out to that extent. Uh, and your boy, it's a boyfriend you have or a husband? A fiance. Fiance. I'm sure things have happened you haven't told him about because you think you didn't have to tell him because you were a good girl and you didn't do anything. But when you're in situations like this, guys always try something 100% of the time. So, oh, no, nobody's ever tried anything. Ever? I mean, no, never. But Nobody ever said, I'm staying downtown at the Ritz-Carlton, come on down and visit me or anything like that? Oh, no, 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 no. No one's ever said, why don't we have a drink after work also or why don't we have dinner tonight also or things like that? No, um, maybe do you want to sit for a drink after work with everybody in the shop? Um, but, yeah, no, nothing like that. I just feel uncomfortable having to be with these men by myself. I understand that. I Look, I, I completely understand that. Sales gigs for women. Uh, i got to tell you something. I've known many women in sales, and I know some of the things women have had to do to close deals. Unbuttoning extra buttons... Uh, going out late at night to close a deal, going to a guy's hotel room with a contract. Uh, you know what? It's actually not that bad. I work like 8.30 till 5, and uh, I don't spend time with anybody outside of that. But I'm, I'm, in, the, I'm in the automotive industry. I'm around men all day long, and I don't that at all. And uh, my fiancé was just so dumb getting this job, and... I do feel a little bit uncomfortable about some stuff sometimes. Uh huh. He doesn't mind, but I do, though. Unbelievable. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, fascinating. Well, no, you can't. Obviously, you can't quit your job. If you're not running into this situation and your fiance is okay with it, well, then uh, that's fine. But personally, I swore off women in sales, I swore off women in the entertainment industry. I swore off actresses, news anchors, news reporters. I, there's a whole group of women I swore off. Yeah, no, I, I don't know. You know what? There is, like, barely any women in this industry also. Like, it's a huge bonus, me being a female working in, in this industry. But, you know, I bonus, mean... The guys, bonus yeah, with a capital... B bonus with a capital bone. Yeah, well, exactly. What are they thinking about? They'd rather see me than a man, right? Uh, of course. And, uh, and if it, you're feels... only 25 years old, Karina. If it hasn't happened already, it will happen. Oh, I'm sure. I'm sure. Some guy's will leg will rub anybody. against your leg. Some guy will say, hey, let's skip out of here and spend the afternoon having uh, mimosas or something like that. Yeah, something like that. But, I mean, at least I know better and I wouldn't do it. But, I mean... When it's a customer and you're trying to be nice and do whatever and, you know, laugh when they flirt with you and stuff, and that's, that's as, as bad as it has gotten. I mean, the guys flirt with me all the time, but, you know, I, I, I don't really like it, so, but it's my job. What am I supposed to do? I completely understand, Corinne. Thank you for the call.